This is Myra Hatfield. <clears throat> you know me as Tuesday Adams. It's July 7th, 2022. I'm getting ready to enroll in my sophomore year at Ball State. Um, <clears throat> I'm getting ready to meet with my success coach and um, see what I can do about getting make, making my sophomore year better than my freshman year. I did make nine credits last year. That's pretty good for as many problems as, as I had with the commissioners and um, <clears throat> in the city and police um, with stalking and harassing and theft. Of course, they, you know, didn't want me to go through college because, you know, I didn't lose my kids. They forced me to lose them and to steal my property. I had a $120,000 house in Belleville. And, um, you know, I planned to sue the commissioner or the mayor um, and the police chiefs and sheriff um, because, you know, they, they forced me to lose my kids and lied about my reputation. I was a new drug addict. I was an alcoholic. He lied on the police reports. Um, you know, I was at parenting class for three hours, and he arrested me for an OWI. I could have got out of that. He told me that um, somebody called the police and saw me sideswipe a vehicle. Nobody called the police. He lied. He's been stalking me and watching me and trying to bully me. He used the power, the police power, to bully me, bully me out, and judges and lawyers' powers, bully me out of my house so they could take it. I want the house back. Um, how dare you hurt my children and me? My children were severely abused without me there to protect them. You didn't protect me either. You tried to kill me too. Um, that this last semester or this last year, my freshman year, my husband shot himself with a gun, made suicide in November. Um, that same week, the commissioner towed my vehicle, my RV. Then, um, in March, right before I got my student loan, because they didn't want to give it to me, because those are commercial commissioners that do that. That's their circle. And they know better than to, to force me to lose my kids and then force me out of college and act like I'm stupid when I'm not. To force me to get bad grades or to keep me home, sitting at home, so I can't go to school. And to keep me from being successful. I, mean, I have the right to pursue happiness. I have the right to pursue an education and happiness. I have the right to have the truth and justice done. Um, you need to apologize to me and my kids and you need to give me my home back. I had a $120,000 home in Delville and they bullied me out. So, And the commissioner is the one that keeps towing my vehicle. He towed, he, in March he towed my RV twice illegally and lied about it. So it was abandoned. He knew I lived in it. I'm, November, he did it once. I mean, where, was it, where do you expect me to sleep? In the tent? Out in the blizzard cold? In my convertible? And they stole my convertible. I never did get it back. But they see every little thing I do. Okay, um, I, twice I parked in the wrong pi a place, so they say. Or I was I was over, I, I was in class for an hour, and I got a ticket because I'm there for too long, over an hour. Okay, um, and then they broke in my, my storage shed and stole my moped. At the same time in March, they stole my moped, broke in my storage, stole my moped, they stole my convertible, and they stole my RV twice. They stole my RV twice. Tell me that's not in the commissioner's circle. Do they, do they see everything under the sun in the city? And then they didn't find my, my convertible? No, nothing wrong with it. And then I have, I got this new car, this new trailblazer, but um, it runs, but it's like I can't take it out of town. That's their fault. These people are controlling my whole life. They forced me into a prostitution. They were trying to force me, and they took my kids away, my home away, and forced me to every big guy. They took five, five, five cars from me, and my driver's license for ten years, and lied about me on the reports. Yeah, I'm going to college. Yeah, they're going to pay for that. Eventually, yeah, they're going to pay for that. They're going to apologize to my kids. They're going to pay my kids, and they're going to pay me money for that. 